Ladies and gentlemen, your final roaster of the evening could not even be bothered to wear shoes. <laughs> Put your hands together for Cinderella. <laughs> Believe it or not, bibbidi bobbidi boo. This is the weirdest Real Housewives episode I've ever been on <laughs> in my whole life. Why are we all so mad? We got rich husbands in the end, didn't we? Be quiet. <laughs> I don't even know which one's mine and which one is whoever the fuck's. You know what I mean? Just, I don't know. I keep wandering into your houses. <laughs> I wasn't wearing glass shoes. I was wearing just glasses from the kitchen. <laughs> but thank you for glamorizing the story. <laughs> I appreciate that very much. I like Aladdin. He's one of the poor guys that got a woman in a Disney story. That never happens. But they made it realistic. They're like, he's going to be poor. Give him a vest. Give him long hair. Give him jewelry. Johnny Depp that shit. <laughs> be fine. <laughs> He'll love him. And then what happened in the end, right? He takes over his wife's father's throne. Because anytime a rich girl marries a poor guy, she's like, my dad will give you a job. It'll be fine. <laughs> Come on. It's fine. It's the only way they really put up with it in the end. Why do you guys keep making fun of me for being drunk? Isn't that how we all found our husbands? I thought we were all the same club. I thought we were all, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> we were all there. We all went to the front and we're like, I'm poor, <laughs> here's a tit, let me in. <laughs> and then we found the gray goose, and then we found our, our husbands. <laughs> a lot of evil queens in, in Disney movies just want to take the youth and beauty from the princesses, Ursula, Maleficent, or whatever. It's a warning story. Botox is a necessary evil, okay? <laughs> if we didn't have it, the housewives in Beverly Hills would come out of their homes for the first time in 5,000 years. <laughs> and they would come down and they would kidnap women from clubs and steal their fucking faces. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> let, just let them have with the Botox. <laughs> you know what I'm saying. I'm too drunk for this. I'm too Why are you guys all so sober? I thought we were all drinking Chardonnay together on Tuesdays, Mondays. What is this? <laughs> and you're all so... There's always like a rich prince and like there are also rich princesses that like want to bone him in the movie, you know what I mean? But he doesn't want them. He's like, no, I want a thirsty bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I want something that would appreciate me beyond the stick. She's never going to go anywhere, you know? What I mean? He's not, <laughs> not someone from money. They know how to, they know how to, oh, now that I'm a pr I'm princess, I have to do like charity work and show up at things sober. <laughs> I don't, but I'm supposed to, you know? We're members of like a crunchy club and stuff. <laughs> I pooped in the pool, I'm just saying. <laughs> <sighs> Th all these princes do coke. They don't really know what we're like when they meet us for the first three years, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> we meet them in that phase. And they come out of it and I've like put on 15 pounds. <laughs> I don't know what else, uh, Pocahontas. I guess uh, I guess John Smith was the one that shared the first story of Pocahontas. He came back from America to England, and he's like, I hooked up with this Native American chick, and her dad tried to kill me, but she saved me. And really, actually nobody believed him. You know what I'm saying? Because British guys always go to America, and like, I hooked up with someone, and their friends are like, no, you don't. You have one tooth. Nobody hooked up with you over there. <laughs> Convenient story, buddy, that she's dead now. And she can't confirm this at all. Yeah, did somebody say, oh, shit, to the one tooth thing? Really? I mean, I pooped in the pool before. <laughs> I don't know. If I really was told last night that I would be here. Did you guys know that the Sleeping Beauty thing is based on a story where, where the prince, in the story, it says he stole the first fruits of her love, and then um, she woke up and she had babies. So Disney was like, we want to do, like, um, like an episode of I didn't know I was pregnant. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Meets a frat house. What do we call it? <laughs> Sleep, sleeping beauty. I'm sure that's what the girls at frat houses call themselves also when they <laughs> wake up from the... Okay, thanks. <laughs> <laughs>